How many people with guns are going to be in here even though we just opened the door? Too many to count? No secrets for me? Not even me, your biggest fan, Drake? Huh. Well, here's where we got the Jolden... J Jolden... Uh, Gould Cross. It's alright. Huh. Nothing here, unless... But maybe... Well, hello there. I was gonna try punching it. You gotta be kidding. <sighs> hey, Sully. I'm here. Remember Roman and Navarro? That red herring you sent them on to get them out of the way? Yeah? Well, they're sitting right on top of the treasure vault. Oh, of all the goddamn luck. Look, I'm gonna need a diversion to get them out of there. You got it, kid. One diversion. Coming right up. And Sully. Yeah? Once they're gone, meet me in the mausoleum. But come through the catacombs. It's safer that way. Gotcha. Now I've just gotta get past all these goons without getting noticed. Did we specifically tell Sully that we ended up here? I, I, I kind of was blanking out. I know we did radio in on him. I guess we did eventually at the uh, end there. But I, I feel like we were like in the catacombs forever. I, I didn't remember telling him nothing. Don't know why I had to jump up for that. Sullivan has escaped. Spread out. Find him. <laughs> okay. Was that the distraction? Nate said to try to do this without getting spotted. But I kind of feel like that's not going to be a thing. We have a sniper rifle too. Which, depending on how this goes, I might go for... How many people are here? Three. I mean, I'm sure many are going to start walking out of the hole. And four, I see another guy over there. there he, is. he saw me, even though I thought I was behind a rock. There is a sniper land. Like, I, I doubt there's an extent that I can really keep being sneaky here. But I do... I don't know. I would love the idea of being sneaky. I think, like, Uncharted 2 starts where you have, like, a silenced... I think it's a dart gun. I don't know if I can sneak attack you when you're... Sitting there. Last time when there was a guy sitting, I didn't have, like, an animation for it. So I feel like this would get wonky. What are you doing, Drake? Guess I'm gonna try, because I... Don't know if he'll move. Oh, he's moving! Yeah, they like... Oh, did you see the way that that red line... The red line, the, uh... The, uh, the... It is a red light. Yeah. There's just a better word for it, and I'm blanking. The, um, red sight. The, the sight line. Oh, fuck you! Anyways, did you see the way the laser sight moved? It definitely moved uh, independent of the, uh, the person. Don't. Oh, that wasn't... And of course they see me and I'm... They in worse cover than I was before. I'm gonna die here. Yeah. Getting shot twice. This dude's over here, Rocket Man. Uh, I thought I was going for an actual, like, stealth kill animation. I wonder, though, if I would have, um, beat him up fast enough if it would have counted as a, uh, silent takedown. 
still against that. I want to see if I can just drop down here and... All right. Yeah, they don't know. I think he's going to just hang out there the whole time. Ooh, shotgun lad. Shotgun lad's probably going to get in my way. If I can knock him the fuck out before he... He's going to see me. He's here. And I'm going to die mid-combat. Okay, so, I mean, I think what I would want to try to do then... That was way too soon. I don't know what I was thinking. I forgot they weren't in their position immediately. I mean, stealth isn't really the best option, clearly. You won't be so lucky this time. Of course, you saw me from that. I don't know if he turned around. I like how we donkey punched that dude, though. We didn't have to do a full combo. I mean, how well would the sniper rifle work here? How safe can I be up here, too? Probably not very safe. I'd assume this box can eventually blow up. Can't climb back up. I know we can deal with this guy, but it'll wake him up. So maybe if I try it from a better corner. Surprise melee works, but... Oh, never mind. Well, uh, yeah, I guess it makes sense that shotgun guy would. I, I know I'm not, like, hitting him, but I'm trying to just stop him from shotgunning me. Damn it. It was kind of working, just spritzing the area. Okay, uh, best thing, I think, would be to... Maybe try stealth killing this dude, and then I had enough time to get back up here. Okay, they saw me. Get down into the hole. The hole looks like there would be a treasure there. Stealth kill the dude. I'm not going to pick that up because I'm only picking up one bullet. Actually, why even bother? Just do this. Uh-oh. Cool. Since it still counts as cover. Not the best cover. Tell you that for free. And then shotgun very well. Oh. He didn't die. Oh, he did. Okay. I think that's grenade man. Sightline dudes over here. And dead. I don't know where Grenade Man went. Oh, there he is. I'm a little afraid of him, if you aren't aware, because one good shot and I'm dead. Oh, and there's another sightline guy.
wasting ammo, but again, as long as I can get them to, like, recoil, that means they're not shooting me. And I think that's the most important thing when it comes to enemies like this and shotgun. Well, most enemies, honestly. I think the, um... I think that fence is, like, a solid object, because I can't shoot through it. Never mind. Damn it. Stop it. Probably more enemies. The music didn't stop. Two minutes remain. But assume they're all up here. Oh, there's one. Ooh, a couple. Oh, no. Hopefully they don't circle behind. I ran out of grenades. I thought maybe those would be good throws. Trying to be sneaky. Okay, I know there's one more guy up here. There he is. I, I don't want to, like, risk... Doing anything a little too silly. Especially when, like... Magnetizing the cover gets a little wonky sometimes. Just need you to... Position yourself better. I wonder if I can shoot through this. I was struggling with it before. He can. Oh, right, I can't shotgun. I'm sure that he can shoot me. Oh, there's two guys. No. Okay. He was shotgun, which is scary. I just need, like, a bead on him with this, uh, blind fire. I'm sure we can... God, blind fire is really difficult to figure out. And we're good. Are we good? And we're good! It's crazy how not even bothering with stealth worked out a lot better for us. And I know, like, again, I, I always say it. It's a bit lame that I'm just, like, hiding and turtling. But considering that that was, um, the last guy left was a shotgun man. Golden Kamask. One shot totally could have killed me. So, of course, I want to play it a little safe. Uh, that being said, kind of low on my pistol ammo right now. Pretty good shotgun. 
I guess if I wanted to, I could have tried heading back to get the uh, sniper rifle. But I feel like that would have, um... The problem with heading back is that they can start wandering the, uh, the enemies. I'm not gonna try to do anything down there. I feel like there could be something, but I don't really want to go for it. Has to be some extra pistol ammo around, right? Desert Fives. Maybe I need to pick up a Desert Five for now. Also, great distraction. They got, like, two of the named people to leave the area. I don't really see anything else, and we already got a treasure, so... I had to assume, though... It, it really probably is a mistake that I'm using this pistol... Because if I have to assume, basically every level starts with this as, like, the default pistol. I'm going to say maybe I should pick up the Desert 5, but I think it's just gone now. Oh, hint! Oh! Oh, I, I gotta go that- Okay. What does this say? Probably actually says something. Hell, we'll probably read that once we leave the, uh, whatever this is. Alright. What goodies lie in here? It's gonna just, like, bring us back to the library or something. Oh. I knew you could do it, kid. So what's next? I don't know. I'm figuring it out as I go. This is definitely the right place, though. You can tell because there's puzzles. Wait a second. It's something to do with these symbols. Really? The symbols? You don't say. So, like, I have to press all of the correct ones? Or, like, the one that's not here? Oh, man. Roman and Navarro really tore this place up. It's not really, um, the seashell is supposed to be, the, okay, some of these are not in the right direction, that's why. I guess I would have known what we had to do if I had played with the, uh, the symbols to see what the problem is, to understand what I need to do to solve the puzzle. Sure we're in the right place? Shut up! Let me do it! I think most of these are just facing up, so if the arrows are wrong, I kind of figured the arrows would be the thing that would be upside down. And I was going to say the only other thing is maybe the cup isn't actually correct because the base and the uh, top part kind of looked similar, but we're good. <laughs> Looks like we're we're doing it! Yeah. Heads up. What do you make of it? I don't know. Could be a dead end. Wait. I would hope not. It looks like there might be a passage this way. Uh oh. Oh shit. What the hell's that? Sully, get out of there. Huh? It's a trap! <laughs> Sullivan, are you okay? Sully! Yeah, yeah, fine. Still in one piece. Oh. You knocked me on my ass, though. Yeah, well, you better get back to the library. We're gonna have to find another way out of here. Get back to the library? Like, well, I, I don't know. Is that really forward. a safe place? Yeah. We're in the treasure's vault. We're doing it! And again, no one should be here, right? No one's made it this far in. Well, that's fancy what is looking. This place? A really elaborate way to hide the damn treasure. It does look elaborate. 
I'm also paranoid about this. Which way do we go? Cause it, it looked like waist high cover, but I, I think it's just a normal pillar that fell. Well, we we go until the hint tells us where to go next. Elena, don't you know how to play video games? I'm stuck, Elena. Oh, there's like a puzzle thing here. Can't even touch that yet. Wait till the book says. There we go. Wait a second. Wait a second. My book says things. There are Roman numerals on the corner of Drake's map. This has got to mean something. Okay. I'll stay here and keep a lookout while you figure out how we're gonna get across. Like, I don't know if I would really call this super maze-like. I guess they really thought this would be a puzzle. Really? Wait. Let me see, what was the hint? So like, obviously we don't go that way, but... Can we? We can't even. So like, I don't know. I don't even need to really remember what... That doesn't work either. I don't really even need to remember what the Roman numerals are, because all of the arrows are just pointing oh, in directions man. I can't go. You're completely lost. I'm not! Shut up, Drake! Stop lying! Drake! Like, if I go that way, would I just die? I mean, my assumption would be that maybe I could get some treasures if I go the opposite direction, but it doesn't even look like these are paths. Like, you would think for a maze like this, it would be like, here are crazy paths this that you could take. For something. I mean, I don't need to go that direction, though. So what's the point? Oh, I gotta mash it out. I did it. It's been mashed. Probably can actually just climb around this now. Okay, now this is where things get complicated. You see the- wait, 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 wait. I guess we'll get there when we get there. But I saw something silly. I can't even look at the thing anymore. Um... I guess I need to go for that chain. I saw something silly that I wanted to comment on. So all of that machinery just made this into like a wiggle chain. I was gonna say if it just looked like it was a chain with the fire moving back and forth, it would have been ridiculous, but at least they have some kind of machinery here. Even if I'm not really sure how much that would work. I don't know how machinery works. I guess I can't go down there. I wanted to see if I could go down to that uh outcrop because maybe there would be a treasure but it, it didn't seem like it really wanted me to also like the notebook's just completely gone so they even know it's not a real puzzle dodge rolled I mean two wasn't a solution was it? Sully, you read me? Damn, nothing. Damn, Sully can't read. What am I trying to do here? Can't really jump up. Am I really supposed to try to jump to the side here? I mean, can I, I can jump there most likely. Ah! I don't know, Drake. I feel like maybe you could have found a way to deal with that without just toppling over and dying. Hint? Oh shit, thanks man. Dude, I love when Hint comes and saves me. 
Maybe I did end up going the wrong way. Well, like, I know follow five. Two. Is two part of that hint? We need that. So once we get over there. I almost feel like I would be able to jump that. That's a lot easier than what I tried to do. Who are these arrows for? Like, who needs to solve these puzzles in a way that they're climbing shit? Thought maybe a treasure would be over there. Can I jump that? I'm gonna try. Hopefully it doesn't kill me. I'm dead. Again, not the actual solution, but I thought maybe. Hint? Oh, thank you. I want to explore. But I'm seeing now that exploring is a mistake. Except for the one very specific spot where there would be a bonus treasure. That I just didn't see. Because I gave up on jumping everywhere that's around here. There's the bonus treasure, right down there. Don't- Why, Drake? <laughs> Why'd you climb up, Drake? You needed to stay down. Drake! Hint? Oh, I see. So I just need to find the stairs that go downward, and I should be able to get that bonus treasure, and then hopefully there's nothing else in this difficult maze. I was joking about the difficulty of the maze, but clearly I am struggling. Actually, damn, it looks like the best bet would have been to start from down there, but uh, hopefully when we're done, we'll like open the gate for Elena, and that'll also keep us safe. There we go. That's what you needed to do, Drake. You silly man, you. Actually... All right, up the stairs. I forgot what I did that was wrong last time. Nothing else around here. This is a wacky room. Oh, what does the note say? It, so it's not even like follow these numbers in a specific order. It is just anytime you see the correct number. Which, again, is a really silly puzzle, because for the most part, you could just be running around trying to just follow the, uh, ooh, I don't like this. Just go around trying to follow hey, what looks like it. the right path. Hey, be that thing look whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa! Quick time! I'm dead! So, like, okay, why did they place this here if you were supposed to follow the correct path? I guess the best course of action would be to try to slip like this. I almost died. There's an elevator. Oh, don't, don't fall! Thank you, Drake. I tried to correct myself a little too much. Whoa! What? What a crazy maze. Oh, Drake! <laughs> he just drowned! <laughs> wha- wha- Scream noise! <laughs> wow! At least that was the checkpoint. Probably should have looked to see if I could skip this, but I figured it wasn't an actual cutscene. So they wouldn't allow me to. We should be back at the bottom. Hello! Which means we can get back to 
the treasure, which I think was up and around this. Yes. Silver cup and cover. Let's go. And we'll just pretend that's the only treasure that's in this room, because if there's more, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> I thought she was clapping for a minute. She was like, yeah, congratulations, Drake. You did it. Good job. She wasn't. I think there's just flies in here. We do eventually want to go that way. See if you can find a way to get this gate open. I'll wait here. Shut up. Guess this angle is how I'm supposed to cross over. I'll wait here. You go in there and find guys that want to shoot you or something. I don't know. Hint? What the hell? What was that? Little monkey fella? Little monkey fella living in here? Okay, Drake. Okay, goodbye. Don't know what you were trying to do. Can't skip that cutscene. So, my intention was to just jump over to the next platform. But Drake thought it would be kind of cool to just, like, hop the fence and then just slide down. I don't really know why. I guess we can look at the little monkey fella again. Probably. See if you can find a way to get Shut up! Open. I'm doing it! Little monkey fella. Okay. Don't hop the fence. Look how easy that was. I'm here. Elena, I'm doing it. For you. Actually, what am I supposed to be doing here? Oh no. Elena, I'm stuck and confused. I guess I was supposed to go that way? There is that chain, I guess. That does not look like a grabbable chain. Hint! Hint me! Can't, like, interact with this, so... I don't see anything I could shoot from here. And I think they would have given me a pistol if there was something I was supposed to shoot. Three is not a number, but apparently there's a chain here. Which I did not see until I went to look at the three. It would have been more beneficial for me if that was a two that pointed up. Because then I could have solved the problem. I don't believe that elevator would have caused Thanks, all of this Nate. to happen. Thanks, Nate! I'm so man! Okay, two's that way. Like, unless if there were actual death traps, if you, like, went the wrong way, like, spikes just appeared, I don't really get what the gimmick of these... Roman numerals really would be. Gasp! Eddie. Please don't shoot me. Hey, Bule! Last man alive gets the gold. You lose. <laughs> Kill them both. This just keeps mm -hmm. getting better and better. What? How did they all get down here? At the very least, they're not just, like, already camped out, right? I can accept them busting in, and then we deal with them. Not really happy about it. But it, I don't know, it makes more sense. That grenade probably would completely... ...destroy this wooden bridge. I don't have any grenades. They haven't given me any for a bit. I think that guy has a scary gun. Okay, goodbye, grenade. I feel like these guys should technically be easier because they don't really have the, um... They don't 
they don't have like the body armor. And I guess we were fighting Eddie's goons for most of the game until we got to like the harder. Elena, what are you doing over there? Until we got to the harder guys, which I think probably belong to. I want to wait for him to shoot because I feel like he could easily snap into my direction and completely kill me. I guess I could also just do that. But it's why I didn't want to get out of cover right away. <laughs> Poor guy. Loads more. Scary. Also, a great grenade throw, my man. See this guy over here trying to just get a little sneaky on you. Afraid he's going to try to pop up from the. Like that. Yes, big scary gun. Elena! Oh God, I could be wrong. I feel like she got in the way of the, um... Of the cover trigger? Which meant that I couldn't hide in cover. Which meant that I was exposed and easily taken care of. That should have been a headshot. Fuck you. So I'm a little peeved about that. Didn't really seem fair in my opinion. I can be a little bit more aggressive though because I'm in a relatively okay spot. Hey, I killed many people with this gun. Also wasting a lot of ammo with it, but I, I don't know. Elena, you going up there now? Not going to get in the way of me when I'm trying to hide? Pretty sure there's another dude. Elena's pretty sure too, I think. It's gonna hurt in the morning. How we doing? You stop being in cover, which makes me think we're good. Wes. I I could try picking up a bunch of Wes's now. How many bullets can I hold? Hmm. I don't think we're good. Oh, we're definitely not good. Hello. Oh, no. The West. He's over there. Definitely makes us good. Oh, fuck you. Yeah, okay. Big surprise that the West is... is good at stuff like that. We're good now.